An unprecedented wildfire battle unfolding in Southern California. This is where the fires are burning right now. Dozens of structures are destroyed or heavily damaged. Still have, you know, more than 2,000 firefighters out here, more than two dozen military aircraft continuing to drop water during the day. So hopefully that will make a difference, but still a lot of active fire out there. Uh, and there is still some concern that things uh, could get even worse. The raging fires are a product of months with little rainfall and above normal temperatures. It's not just here in Southern California, it's statewide and we haven't seen conditions like this in decades. Unprecedented number of fires and fire activity across the state, in many cases two to three months earlier than normal. Thousands of firefighters work to put the blazes out, but they're up against record heat, dry winds and low humidity, not to mention fatigue. So far, thousands have been evacuated from San Diego County. It was really terrifying. I was just thinking about, you know, my dogs at home. How am I going to get home? Uh, I was worried about my neighbors. When we were coming up the driveway, we just kind of just saw it and just all broke down, started crying and it just, I've never seen anything like it. As far as like family and, and pets, you just can't just all of a sudden come up with another Rocky. Those flames were moving so quickly and there was a lot of smoke and it was really scary seeing that come up over our neighborhood. Two teenagers into custody. They're questioning whether they might be responsible for some of these big fires. They're accused of basically trying to start a brush fire, but because at one point she had nine fires burning at once, investigators immediately thought that there might be arson. Now many worry this could be just the beginning in San Diego County.